What's up guys, it's Darcy from Ozilax Gaming here, and today I'm going to be bringing you a Man of the Match Lukaku review. Just before we get into the review, if you do like these reviews, hit the like button, it really helps my channel grow, and if you like my content, please hit the subscribe button, don't be shy, hit it. If you do have any like feedback or comments about the video, please leave them in the comments section, I, I read them all and I take them on board, and if you want me to review any players, seriously put them in the comments section because I will review them if they're in my price range and they're good enough. So let's get into the review. Now this guy is an actual beast. He's got 85 pace, 85 shot, 82 ball control, 88 finishing and 83 acceleration. There's not more I'm going to say about this guy, he is just a god. Over the top through balls are even more OP with this guy. He's big, he's black, and he's going to get you a lot of goals. With his four star weak foot, he can just bury it in the back of the net from anywhere. He's just a god with his with both feet even. It's just godly. Um, 92 strength helps a lot with this guy. When you're running past defenders, he can shrug him off. The only downside to it is that when he falls over, it does take him ages to get up. So if he falls over, it's going to take him a good five seconds to get back up and start playing defense or like a counter-attack for instance. Um, he scored me a lot of goals inside the penalty box. His long shots weren't that good, only 77 long shots, which I thought wasn't that bad, but it could be probably be better. Um, massive upgrade from his 80 gold. I found that he played a lot better than his gold card and he scored me a lot more goals in game more games than his normal gold card. Lukaku also did get a 5 plus upgrade on his shot, which I think you can definitely tell in games, the amount of goals this guy scores. Um, high medium work rates, which I found just perfect. Uh, he only goes for 22 to 32k on Xbox and 28 to 51k on PS3, which is a bargain. He is extinct on Xbox and PS3, I think he's extinct as well. So you might have to snipe him off the market, but he's a definite, he's really good buy for his price. Another thing I didn't really like about Lukaku was his dribbling. I felt it to be very slow and sluggish when he went past defenders, but his strength did help him out dribbling, but just not enough to make it something you'd say, oh wow, he has good dribbling. So I'm not going to put it dribbling as a pro, I'm going to put it as a con. He does actually have amazing finishing inside the penalty box. Like nine times out of 10, he will score inside the penalty box, which I think is amazing. With 88 finishing, you're expected to finish pretty much everything inside the penalty box, which this guy does to perfection. So of course, let's get into the pros and cons. Pros for Men of the Match Lukaku is sprint speed, positioning, ball control, finishing, penalties, shot power, and pace. All amazing stats. Uh, the cons are his dribbling, his free kicks, his three-star skills, and his volleys. So Man of the Match Lukaku, 81 rated, is going to get an eight out of 10.